like I've told you before, cloud computing is on fire. It is here to stay. And this is the theme that is levitating all sorts of related stocks. Believe it or not, we are still early. I know that sounds ridiculous, but we are. Take New Relic. It's the cloud-based software analytics company that specializes in application performance monitoring. Basically, they, they help clients keep track of what their business software is doing and how their users are interacting with it in real time. Now, after selling off hard in the fourth quarter of last year, New Relic stock has caught fire in 2017, up more than 55% year to date. Mostly that's because the company's doing very, very well. New Relic reported a bit more than two weeks ago, and they delivered a solid revenue number, that's up 40% year over year, with a smaller than expected earnings loss, and most important, an astounding 54% increase in billings. Plus, management told us that they've won some major new business from huge enterprises like Adobe, LinkedIn, SoFi, remember we had them on last week, Bose, and even Buffalo Wild Wings, among others. So let's, let's catch up with Lou Cerny, he's the founder and CEO of New Relic, get a better sense of how his company's doing and where it's headed. Mr. Cerny, welcome back to Mad Money. Good to see you, Lou. Have a seat. Great to see you, Jim. Thanks for having now, me. The, the cadence is extraordinary here. You pre-announced a much better than expected quarter, and then you crushed even that number. So it's just this a parade of, of, of very large enterprise orders that you're now winning? Well, you know, what's driving all of this is all of these enterprise companies are moving to the cloud. They're moving to digital. They're recognizing, like you mentioned, Buffalo Wild right. Wings. The way they're going to grow their business and reach new customers is through digital and through and through adopting cloud computing. And New Relic helps them by, by providing the dashboard that gives them the visibility they need to succeed. Do you think that I'm wrong by saying we're early when you think about how few companies have really migrated to the cloud? I believe we're very early. There's been a lot of talk for a long time, but remember, these huge enterprises take some time to fully adopt. I was just right. talking to one of the largest uh, companies in the country this morning, and they're talking about... We are adopting the cloud right now, but we're very early. But mark my words, we're going to be all in over the next five years. So we're just seeing the beginning of what will be a massive change over the landscape of IT. Okay, when people hear cloud, they think, wow, Google's got a great cloud. Amazon's the best cloud. They must offer these uh, dashboard analytics. But they have a very elemental. They have not gone as deep as you. No, no. We're the only company that puts visibility into the three most important areas. It starts with the customer experience, like the mobile app mm -hmm. or the browser. Uh, when you when you click on a web page, we see all of that. We see the application that's running inside the cloud environment, and uh, and and then we see the the cloud infrastructure itself, all in one platform that looks across all clouds as well as on premise. So only New Relic really delivers that. There's an outfit. I'm not going to mention them because it, it's it was a breakdown, but they their website went down for a couple hours, and mm -hmm. it was really critical for them. How quickly are you able to identify that kind of problem? Oh, we've seen this many times where customers say, without New Relic, I was blind, now I see. In many cases, we would have detected the problem before it became an outage. Um, but when, when we shine is when there's that moment of truth, there's a problem. You have no time to waste. The cost of an outage might be a million dollars every 10 minutes. And so the faster you can find the problem, the faster you're back up and serving your customers. And that's where what we call the moment of truth for our customers. The yeah, moment of truth occurs a lot. The number of queries you get per minute? Oh, we, we scan over 30 billion data points a minute for our customers. 30 billion? Per second, excuse per me. Second. Per second. Per second? Yes. And how, what is, how do you even have the computing power to do that? We've got proprietary technology we've built from the ground up. Believe it or not, I went to Lake Tahoe in 2013 and built this database from the ground up. You did? I did. I, I, well, I still code from time to time. Okay. Then I handed it off to my engineering team to, to productize it. And now only New Relic has this database that can process this data. Why is that important to our customers? Because think of all that's going on in their digital properties, how much is happening. We see it all in real time to help them identify and fix problems. Now, uh, Cisco made an acquisition, AppDynamics, yep. a competitor. How do you, you, how do you keep the following happening? There's going to come a moment where you're going to break into profitability. I totally agree with what you've done, which mm -hmm. is that you land in and you just expand. What happens when you're right there at that moment and someone big decides, you know what, this is when I can finally buy them and it will be added? Uh, well, look, here's what we see. Uh, we see this massive opportunity firmly in the cloud area. So okay. we do have many competitors. Where we win most often and we're dominate, dominant is when the application is running in the cloud. Okay. Um, our most direct competitor just got bought by a company that predominantly is strong in the data center. Cisco is a networking-centric right. company that serves customers who have their own data centers. So, so we think we can lengthen our lead. That's a big opportunity for a big independent company, and that's why we're managing the business for the long term. In the time since we've known each other, you, I felt that many of your customers were small to medium-sized. These customers are linked in a SoFi. These are huge. So what changed in the perception that people recognize that you're the enterprise guy? 
Well, we've always had the right technology and the right product, right. Um, but we've needed to get the word out to, to enterprise customers of the New Relic way of doing mm -hmm. things. And more importantly, the enterprise customers are moving to our sweet spot, which is, again, the cloud and digital initiatives. Right. Smaller companies were there earlier, and now the large enterprises are getting strategic with the cloud, and that's where we can be strategic to them. Okay, so uh, when you look at uh, how much of what you do now versus what you did was the actual insight and analytical part versus just realizing that someone's not the site's not working. Oh, well, just this week in London, Ryanair, Europe's largest right, airline. Right, talk about that. So they look, they show in real time how many people are booking flights in the site. How does that compare with last week? Where are the bookings coming from? And, and, and so that data in real time is really their whole business. You know, nobody calls a travel agent anymore to right. book a flight. Right. So what's your dashboard for your business? That's what New Relic provides for Ryanair. So okay. it's going way beyond just performance. And the last one, I happen to love REI. I've been a member yeah. of the co-op since it was started, okay? We have beautiful REI store in New York, and there's one right near me, New Jersey. Uh, they always seem to know a lot about me when yeah. I go to the register. Is that you? Well, their strategy is to understand, have a 360-degree view, view of the, the customer, you. They, they do. They do. I feel very at home there. It's fantastic, isn't it? And, and the way to do that is through a lot of software. What if that software doesn't work? If that software doesn't work, they don't understand their customer. We help them ensure that their software works and delivers a great experience. Okay, and then I, I saw that you did with Adobe, and I was trying to figure out why Adobe needs you, since Adobe, I thought, did kind of what you did, but, but Adobe brought you in. Absolutely, because think about all the software Adobe runs and across their various business units that they are moving from historically you know, uh, on-premise software into the cloud. They've been very successful with that, yeah, but as, as they move to a SaaS service, um, they needed New Relic to make sure they are delivering great service levels to their customers, and that's how we so help So they Adobe. use you to Absolutely. figure it out. Well, congratulations, because they were fabulous. Well, all these outfits are fabulous. It's fantastic. That's Lou Surdy. He's the founder and CEO of New Relic. Look what this stock has done in the time since we've learned about what Lou's up to. And it's right, because they've got the right stuff to win. Mad Money's back in for the break. Booyah! Jim Cramer here from Mad Money. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube. Click here to subscribe and get the jump on my exclusives with CEOs, plus market news, investing advice, and a whole lot more.